We named Restaurant Tocqueville after Alexis de Tocqueville, who wrote Democracy in America. We felt that the spirit of our food had a lot to do with what Tocqueville wrote about. When we designed this restaurant, we wanted to make sure that we had a very comfortable entranceway where a group of people could stand together. If you walk in with a computer and you don't want to check it with everyone else's things, we put it in a locker for you and you get the key. It's a very luxurious environment, but still, I think, a very comfortable environment. The cuisine is French in technique, you know, prepared in a more modern way with lots of uh, puree vegetables and jus as opposed to like a more heavy classic cuisine. It's a more lighter version of uh, what the French cuisine is thought of being. Whenever we try to create a new dish, one thing that really comes to mind is that the ingredients should speak for themselves and instead of doing more with them, I try to do less. And very often, I try to display different techniques of cooking the same ingredient in different ways so that you can really showcase what that product is all about. Right now we have a cod dish which is salt cured and served as a casserole with a side of fresh cod. So you have the textures and the different flavors of cooking it differently. I think that Tocqueville is a New York restaurant more to New Yorkers than to out of towners. So I think that if you want to have a true New York experience, Tocqueville is that type of restaurant where we don't specifically set out to cater to tourists or not to tourists. The people that come here regularly are true New Yorkers. And I think why they like Tocqueville is you can come and really forget about what your day had been like. 